Now, Trump says he hates Taylor Swift. That's kind of crazy. I would be trying to lick up to Taylor Swift. I have over 420 million followers. Hopefully they all can vote. But you know if Taylor Swift followers get out there and vote like that, and if they're all, you know, able to vote, that's a landslide. So why are you going to say something like that? That's hard. That's cruel. I hate Taylor Swift. That's giving your base say, I hate her. Go get her. That is horrible. And Trump just do too much in with the rhetoric and he wants to complain about people trying to shoot him. But he's the one to divide the country. The country is so divided because of him. And a lot of people that did have no hate in their heart, when you brainwash somebody, it will come out. And the thing is, a lot of people are so gullible, they, re they believe anything somebody tells them. So he's just repeating this stuff, repeating the stuff about the people in Springfield, the Asians, needing the cats and the geese and the dogs and everybody else. And people are believing this mess. But I, all I have to say, the mega Republicans, if you're thinking about a civil war or just getting crazy if Trump doesn't win, uh, this is not Trump. Biden is the president. He will not allow that. So uh, you need to think twice about what you want to do if Trump doesn't win because a lot of people will get hurt and it'll be all Trump's fault. So, you know, you just can't go around hate, saying you hate people because you got people who believe in you. And it's horrible. But Taylor got over 420 million followers on uh, Instagram. I don't know what she got on the other platforms, but that's a good thing. So I'm sure they are going to follow Taylor and vote for Kamala.